I'm here in Ohio today uh, to once again impress upon our people, and not just in Ohio, all across the country, and not just AFSCME people, but all AFL-CIO members, how critical and important this election is. We have been battered and bruised as working men and women in this country now for eight years by some of the most deceitful people that have taken the middle class, shrunk the middle class, closed plants, done all of those kinds of things and shifted the wealth in America uh, to the richest people and to the richest corporations. Uh, this may be our last chance in terms of working men and women, in terms of American labor. We know where uh, McCain stands, uh, Sarah Palin stands, we know that uh, they're with Bush and Cheney uh, all the way. McCain has voted some, since he's been in Congress and in the Senate, some 17 percent for the aspirations and needs of working men and women. Obama has voted 100 percent and Joe Biden 90 percent. So it doesn't take um, mind-altering science to figure this out. And so we've got to get out and mobilize everyone that we can. We've got to get out on walks. We've got to get on those phones. We've got to put literature out. We've got to be in the working place. We've got to be in the shops. We've got to be in the, in the schools. We've got to be in all those places because come election day, we're going to need every vote that we can get to change the course and direction of America.